The key to our future is within you, it is within me, and it is within each and every one of us. Your soul signature, true soul essence, wishes to shine, to have a voice, a song, a vision, a presence, a story it shares. Upon entering this collective preparation period, I invite you to our new future and the great becoming. The energies surrounding this winter solstice are a preparation for a collective up-leveling. And as I tuned in for this winter solstice energy update, I was being shown a energetic birth space, almost as a energy vortex or a quantum portal of frequencies and within this formation from december to late march there seems to be almost like this in-between blank space and the new rising of becoming of energies of new pathways simultaneously existing within the same energetic space which I found very interesting because despite sensing many internal energy frequencies as more traditional winter solstice energies or for the winter season, there is this other thread showing that we will be almost building our future at the same time. And I kept hearing that this is a very futuristic winter solstice from the beings of light, they were showing me that there is a deeper understanding on a collective level how effective it is to tend to our inner world at this time and not see it as in action or that we're not taking action or that we are not developing or that we are not building because what we are doing is we are internally developing, progressing, integrating a bit more as we are building our future from the inside out. What I was being guided to relay is how groundbreaking developments begin within us. And the invitation, they were giving me the phrase, building castles in the sky. And can we believe? So what this is displaying is the facilitation of us beginning to live more within the 5D New Earth paradigm. This season and time is about developing visions, setting energetics within ourselves, and becoming that vision so that we can see the blossoming start to come forth more through us and through our external. And this is being shown as lining up with spring equinox. And so this is really a season of deep soul level restoration and renewal. There have been so many energetic upgrades and major celestial transits and events and portals that we have all received some massive upgrades of light from and so I am seeing that there is this deeper level upgrade that needs some time within our energetic template and within our DNA structure to fully take place and be able to radiate and embody more of our becoming and our light. A theme that I was picking up on is that there may be this version of this fog effect or a lack of visibility and that also being mixed in with bursts of clarity and forward actions and movement and i feel that this goes back to the birth space energetic formation of the blank space and the new rising being simultaneously weaved because in between this preparation for our future, it's starting to take place in the now with these next upcoming months ahead. 
it's that medium space in the becoming into the new and seeing the series of new energies, new events, new experiences, new people, new alignments, and new versions of yourself actually beginning to take material form. But yet there is still a becoming along with the new. And so there might be this effect that we may sense where things feel foggy, they still feel shrouded, and then having bursts of new and taking action and also still honoring where we need some integration period for the upgrades, downloads, and the preparation for our future. And also honoring that our future is in a ways beginning to take place in the now. Another theme that was being brought to my attention was about restoration to our true nature. And this was coming through as 5D development for the new paradigm and that this was really important. And this goes back to the opener message about holding the key for our future. And this is our soul signature. This is our truth, our gifts, and the unfolding developments for that preparation to be restored to our true nature. What this means is that our true nature is what we call the 5D paradigm, to be living in those energies, to be an embodiment of those energies, and to bring that forth. And that process of coming back to our true nature takes a lot of work through the awakening in the ascension process. And so it's very important developmental time because you may sense yourself moving into these processes that feel restorative to your blueprint of who you truly are on a soul level and prior to specific events and energies in your life themes beliefs that allow you to truly own your soul's signature and your soul's essence this can also link in as well with the inner child and allowing yourself to somehow work into retrieving your true nature from your inner child or finding yourself being guided that way and taking it further from the inner child into your true soul spirit essence this can look like connecting into your higher self and allowing this higher self integration to take place more within your physical world avatar embodiment and owning that as your true nature of your soul your spirit and as more of us begin to move into these processes there are more spiritual gifts that come online through the soul through our true nature as keys to our true energetic frequencies and understanding that also there are specific people who we also link with who hold keys for frequencies in which we are interlinked with to rise with at specific times. And so I am sensing this alignment of keys, keys in self, keys in others, and those soul signature key energetics coming together to create this 5D development of our new future. And I am being guided to the channeled activation affirmation. If this aligns for you, I invite you to place your hands over your heart with me and speak in your own ways or just openly receive with me. With this winter solstice, I now call upon my higher self to allow me to integrate into a deeper level soul restoration of my true soul's nature. I am setting intention for my essence of truth at the level of my soul 
to embody through my human level expression and allowing myself to connect in with source frequencies, with higher level light, to own my truth, to own my power, and to own the truth of my own soul signature key that is ready to be reborn within this winter solstice cycle. I am ready to claim and remember my soul source key so that I can activate my new future. And as I activate my new future within, I trust and I know that this activates the new future within others, as all is one and one is all. Thank you, so be it, so it is, and it is received. That was all that I was guided to share for this winter solstice energy update. If this video was resonant for you, please leave a like on this video to let me know. If you feel aligned to subscribe to this channel, to join this growing community, it would be an honor. And I love hearing everyone's resonation down below in the comments as it also helps me to know too that we are walking this journey together and I hope that it is providing to you the same expression in your own journey as well. Thank you so much for tuning in with me and I hope to join here again with you next time.